Could you drive? What? Someone's Byron Hansen. To get a hold of myself. Don't say I didn't warn you. I have a meeting, so I won't be able to drive you home. If you didn't drive last night, I'd call you. No, no, no. It's okay. I live close by. I can walk. Okay. Yes. Get the numbers ready. Make sure everybody's in the room before I get there. I'll be there in 23 minutes. <sighs> Goodbye, Miss Lane. Goodbye, Mr. Hanson. What is wrong with me? He's my ex fiance's uncle. I need my engagement ring back. My mom said. It's a family heirloom. Is this because my family went bankrupt? It's not my fault. Your dad committed suicide and left a huge Don't mess. Don't talk about my father. Oh my God, he, he's so hot. I should, I should talk to him. I should go. Get, get it. You don't stand a chance with Byron. He is the richest man in L.A. You're so mean. Who has it? He doesn't date. Oh, baby, it might seem like a crush, but it doesn't mean that I'm serious. Cause you lose all my senses. That is just so typically me. Oh, it's you. Hello, Mr. Hanson. I'm gonna go order a drink from the bar. You want anything, Byron? No, I'm fine. Okay. What are you doing here? Can a girl get a drink by herself? Let go. I don't want to. I'm your fiance's uncle. Ex-fiance. I guess you didn't get the memo, Uncle Byron. In Easton, we broke up. And? And I say. So this is about revenge. So what if it is? Revenge is a dangerous game, Miss Lane. Are you afraid, Mr. Hanson? Because I'm not. I want this. Don't say I didn't warn you. It's okay, Cora. It's not like you are ever going to see him again. You're good. You are a capable, smart, powerful woman, and you do not need a man in your life. Hello? Cora, your mother has woken up from her coma. <sighs> we should let her rest. Um, we should talk about billing. We've discussed your situation, and I know that this is going to be a lot of money for you. We could try a more conservative approach, but... No. I'll get the money. You just focus on getting my mom better. She's all that I have left. Cora, what are you doing here? <laughs> hey, Cora, now's not a good time. I'm kind of in the middle of something. Look, Easton, I just need one simple thing. I need the 50K that you owe me so that I can... My uncle is here. Let's talk later. <laughs> really? Cora! <laughs> you and Easton are through. You can stop begging to get him back. What are you even doing here? I just want what's mine. Easton asked for my engagement ring back. I think I can ask for my gifts back too. Look, 2019, I gave you that Mont Blanc pen, $15,000. 2020, the Rolex watch on your wrist, um, $40,000. Uh, 2021, the Giorgio O'Keefe painting. And then 2022, the Land Rover sitting right out there. You gave that to me for my birthday. You can't ask for that back. You proposed and gave me that engagement ring. You can't ask for that back. Look, just give me the 50K and we never have to see each other again. Not one time. I'll give you the money if you beg me for it. How does it feel to be a nobody now? I need my engagement in back. The princess has fallen from her tower. Mia Thompson is your new girl. Cora, can we talk in private about this, please? What was that you said, Easton? <laughs> right. You would never be with Mia even if she was the last person on earth. I did not say that. You little bitch. That's enough. Uncle Byron. 
Easton, it seems your new girlfriend lacks manners. Uncle Byron, you don't understand. Cora Uncle! Is that title needs to be earned. Or did I miss the wedding? Are you married to Easton? Well, we are engaged. You don't have to piss off my uncle. I can't believe he's taking Byron, us. let's just go back and talk about the Maple Plaza project. Stop embarrassing yourself at my house. I just need the money to pay for my mother's Shh. medical bills. Keep the gifts. I'll figure it out on my own. That rude child! Byron. Let's reschedule. I have something I need to attend to. Wait! Byron! Get in. It's $50,000. What, you're not going to take it? Thank you so much. I promise I will pay back every penny. <laughs> um, with interest, like a loan, 3%. Of course you'll be paying me back, but under my conditions. I'll, I'll have you know, Mr. Hanson, I'm not like that. I'm not going to sell my body for money. <laughs> so, you think you're only worth 50000 What's gonna happen next? Found out on Real Short.